welcome to another Silk Central demonstration. This video will cover how to import requirements from Microsoft Excel into Silk Central. With this, you will now have the ability to import requirements from both Microsoft Word and Excel, the industry leading requirement tools. First, let's take a look on how to format an Excel spreadsheet so it easily imports into Silk Central. In the first row of the spreadsheet, I'm going to put in column headers, which will be called ID, Parent ID, Requirement Name, one word, Requirement Description, one word, Priority, Risk, and Reviewed. These headers match the default mapping settings inside Silk Central, making for an easy import process. However, you certainly can edit the mapping settings to format it more towards your own standards or terminology. With the headers in place, we'll skip ahead and fill in two sample requirements. Notice how in the second sample requirement, the parent ID is number one. Well, if the parent ID matches an ID from another requirement, which this does, it indicates that the requirement is a child of another requirement. All right, now that our Excel spreadsheet is saved and ready to go, I'm going to log into Silk Central and show you how to easily import the requirements. To do so, I'll click on requirements in the menu and then right click on the file node that you want to use as the parent node or folder of the imported requirements. In this case, I'll put them under the web shop node and click import from Excel. The default Excel mapping file, which matches our spreadsheet, is already set. However, if I needed to change the mapping to my own customized terminology, I can click edit mapping and make the changes inside here. Again, we are already set, so I'll cancel out. I'll find and upload my Excel spreadsheet and then click OK. And that's it. The spreadsheet of the requirements was successfully imported. Now if we expand the node, we'll find our two requirements. One, the parent, which was our first requirement, and two, its child, which was our second requirement. And there you have it, an easy way to import your Excel requirements into Silk Central. That's it for this demonstration. For more information, you can check out our online documentation page, enroll in our web-based training, visit our online community, or check out other videos by subscribing to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.